As the Russia-Ukraine war continues to rage on, Ukraine is slowly inching closer to receiving F-16 jets from NATO countries. And President Volodymyr Zelensky has made some definite headway. Zelensky arrived in the Netherlands with the aim to strengthen his country's air power. And he has now received commitment to receive fighter jets from Dutch Prime Minister Mark Root. Both leaders issued a joint statement and confirmed this development. Root said that the Netherlands has a total of 42 F-16s available. However, it is too early to state whether all of them will be donated to Ukraine. Today we can announce that the Netherlands and Denmark commit to transfer F-16 aircraft to Ukraine and the Ukrainian Air Force in close cooperation with the United States and other partners once the conditions for such a transfer have been met. Meanwhile, the Ukrainian president has hailed the decision to strengthen Kyiv's air force as historic. Що про, про кількість F-16 ми можемо про це говорити, а, які будуть надані Україні після тренування а, а, пілотів а, та інженерів. The pledge is the first real promise of F-16s for Ukraine's armed forces. The developments come on the heels of United States approving the possible delivery of the fighter jets by the Netherlands and Denmark. However, the transfer will not happen immediately. The Nordic nations have made it clear that it would take some time to properly train Ukrainian pilots and prepare required infrastructure for operating the jets. The pilot training program will take place in Denmark and Romania. In theory, F-16s will allow Russian jets that fire missiles from a distance to be intercepted, challenged and repelled. It may help Ukrainian forces strike Russian helicopters targeting Ukraine's territorial armored systems. Furthermore, the new F-16s armed with upgraded software will enable Kyiv to employ NATO munitions and missiles more effectively. Weon is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.